Hey guys, this is Chris with Real Truck. We are inside the truck and Jeep Hall at SEMA 2017, and I'm here with Greg from Fab Fours. We're checking out some of their builds, some of their new products, and I'm gonna turn it over to him to tell you all about their new products this year. All right, thanks for stopping by. So these trucks, uh, we've got a Ford Chevy Dodge in the booth. So for one, brought critical mass that these real products yeah. are actually gonna be coming to market. It's not a one-off build. We're really playing on the success that we had with the Jeeps. So we pioneered and patented the Grumper, a grill bumper combination. Debuted that about a year and a half ago, and it's been awesome. We launched the Vical for the Jeep, which is a windshield surround, had no purpose on earth other than looking cool. Also very successful. So we thought we'd take that magic sauce, apply it to trucks. So you don't really see that very often. The truck space has been pretty stagnant. You know, lift, big tires, pick a bumper, add some lights. To take it to this level where you've really got a bunch of colors and you can sit there with a blank palette and think of what your truck should look like, that's what we're trying to achieve here. So even this Grumper is 13 pieces included in the single part number. So you've got a low center winch mount, the wings that bolt on, a full center grill section, and then each one of these inserts is actually three pieces, the front fascia, the tunnel, and the back mesh. If your eye is drifted to, yeah, I see what you got there with the looks, I want to know about the stance. Two years ago, we brought Krypton, which was, we had everything green. We had the Mohawk Jeep, oh, yeah. and we had the green and black Ford on 40s. Right. So that was, you know, following the trend I like, low stanced out. So we did that with the original Legend three years ago, 50s okay. no lift. Well, here, this is ready to go to market. So we have the HDs on 40 inch tires, 40-15-5, with a big offset still, negative right. 44, no lift, just a leveling kit. So that's a big deal, because you really get that stanced out feel, and especially on the Chevy. So with that, you spotted the Skunk Works we've got going. Yeah, I, I did see a couple of prototypes on the truck, but before we get to those, I also saw that those open fenders do come in a couple different options as well. So it's not just the flat side on the Chevy, uh, you do have one with a little bit of extended coverage yep. it looks like as well. Yeah, so the basic kit is the base fender system, which is really the utility that allows you to fit the 40. So for anybody that might be intimidated out there, you know, don't worry. We've got the shops dialed in with our extensive kit of templates that says cut here, what to do, and we cover the cut. That's going to be my trademark's tagline for this. So anything that might happen in that cutting process, yeah. you don't have to worry because we're going to cover it with the base. As you mentioned, there are a couple of prototypes on this truck as well. Maybe a little Skunk Works project for you. Tell yep. us about those. So we were trying to keep a low profile with it, which is not really conducive with this interview. But I'm going to show off our new wheel. Well, it is here at SEMA. It's here. So it's, it's out Cats there. Cats out of the bag. Yeah, that's right. So we have a little different approach. You know, it's not for everybody. One size, 24 by 12. Okay. And I'll tell you where I'm coming from there. There's so many SKUs per one style because they've got every size, every offset, every bore, every lug pattern. I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna have 12 SKUs, one size. If you like it, buy it. And our wheels are gonna be able to deliver with an in-stock guarantee promise. Awesome. Okay. All right, now we're behind the Dodge. We've got one more new product to show us. Go ahead and tell us about that. Yep, so this is a prototype, kind of a last minute ad. This was on our, if we get to it, for SEMA list. But knowing that we were gonna launch these open fender systems, which was gonna drive the popularity of 40s, I'd like to think it, 40 will be the new 37, now right. that we're making that accessible yeah. to people. What we have is a very flexible tire carrier that comes in a couple options. So this will mount a 37 to a 42. And you get this kind of Baja style raked mounting, but yet it also, it's on rollers for the different sizes to keep okay. it centered in the bed and pins. So you get it where you want it in the middle, but then if you need to put a dirt bike in the bed or haul some wood home, this tire carrier actually flips all the way up to the vertical position and can ride in that position, leaving the whole bed with full access. And you'll see that's awesome. by tying it into the frame, we actually left the, the whole bed as it is rather yeah. than you know getting that structure from bridging the whole gap. Gotcha. So I see, yeah, is this all part of the tire carrier here on the back of the so this, truck? Talk about last minute. This was the day before we left. We got, you know what? It's pretty ugly back there. So okay. this is a tailgate delete kit, <laughs> nice. which covers all that because you still have those posts and sure. some of the paints a little yeah. bit off there, and you get a gap where the tailgate bottom was. So it made sense. So we got this sexy yeah. looking new tire carrier. You're, you're giving up your tailgate. That's a fact. 
We should probably do something to cover it. And people are gravitating to this as actually it's exciting yeah, this as is that. Actually, it is. It is. Because like you said, once you lose a tail, it looks like you're missing something. Yep. I mean, there's Absolutely. no other way to put it. All right. Well, thanks for telling us about your new products. If you guys like what you saw here, go ahead and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Follow us on Instagram and Facebook, and we'll see you on the next video.